this is all you need for this recipe. Stay tuned. Saltine crackers, chocolate chips, brown sugar, pecans, and butter. Hey y'all, it's Jan at Simply Jan Homestead. Thanks for coming along today. Uh, Misty at Mama Z's Kitchen asked me to join in a collaboration for um, making snacks. What's our favorite snack? And um, so it's called the 2019 Snack Attack. And I'm really happy she asked me to come along. So today we're going to make toffee saltine cookies. And I'm going to show you what's in it real quick. And um, then I'll do the rest. So you take a little over a sleeve of saltine crackers, put them on a cookie sheet, just like that, lay them out. I have pecans, brown sugar, one cup, and semi-sweet chocolate chips. And then I'm going to take this butter and melt it in the pot on low. I have my oven preset to 400 degrees. And um, so what I'm going to do is go ahead and start melting the butter. And you bring the butter and the brown sugar to a boil. And then... I'll show you the rest. Be back in a minute. Okay, y'all. So I've got the brown sugar boiling with the butter. It's two sticks of butter. And you want to get it to a rolling boil. Just make sure the butter and the brown sugar are incorporated real well. And then once you know all the sugar's dissolved, whoops, sorry, um, you're going to bring that over here Kevin can you come help me I'm gonna have Kevin hold the camera for me while I show you what to do so you have this mixture and then you're just gonna pour it over your crackers and like a drizzle I guess I just want to say this is not my recipe. I got this about oh a year or two ago from the Big Family Homestead. Brad and Krista did a video on it. And we made these last year and I mean we just I bet we made about 10 batches of this. It was so good. <laughs> we gave them away to friends and our neighbors and yeah, it's pretty cool. They're really good. So once you do this mixture, um, it'll spread out on, pretty much on its own, but I still like to get all the crackers and make sure they're covered. I'm sort of weird that way. But it does spread out. Okay, so once you've got all the mixture on there, Then you're going to put it in the oven for five minutes. Just five minutes, guys. So here we go. And then basically what you're doing is you're just letting that spread out and heat up. And um, then when that's done in five minutes, we'll be back. See you in a minute. Okay, we're back. It's very important when you're recording something that you push record. So I didn't record, but I'm going to show you what the next step is. The next step is to take your chocolate chips. It's a little over a cup. I, I sort of like to put more on there. But you see they're starting to melt. And then you put your chips on there. And then just sprinkle whatever nut you like. I like pecans. I'm a pecan freak. Um, so just chop pecans all over the top. And um, you're going to, like I said, don't touch this, y'all. It is so hot. But just put your pecans on there and... Let this cool off. It takes probably about 20 minutes to cool off. 
and then you can take your bread cutter you can take whatever you want to cut it and um, you just cut it into pieces into sections so basically you know you can cut it cut it cut it cut it and um, then enjoy well that is our toffee cookie recipe and in 20 minutes to a half hour we're gonna be eating it <laughs> y'all have a great day be blessed don't forget to like share and subscribe because i know there's someone who wants this high calorie snack there's gotta be <laughs> y'all have a great day thank you